Today, I'm doing a Minecraft mob battle with my girlfriend, but we can mix skibbity toilets. For example, if I put a cameraman on this side, a dragon head on the other side, and I splash the middle with our mixing potion, it will make this super cool dragon cameraman. And of course, I'm also using one-way glass, so I know exactly what my girlfriend Zoe makes. Well, anyway, Zoe, are you excited for today's skibbity mixing mob battle? I am beyond excited. You are so going down this time. I can tell today is going to be my day. No way, Zoe. You're totally going to lose, but I'm going to give you five minutes to mix your first skibbity mob, so best of luck. Good luck, Dax. Okay, guys, now that Zoe can't hear us, I can just easily use our super cool woman glass to see exactly what she's gonna mix. And oh gosh, it looks like she's starting already. This side, I'm gonna start off with the skibbity toilet. Okay, that's pretty simple. She's just a skibbity toilet. I wonder what she can do for the other side. Then for the other side, I'm gonna add a zombie. Wait, a zombie in a skibbity toilet? I wonder what this will end up making. Now I just need to splash some of the mixing potion on here. And wait a second, guys. I think it made some type of zombie zombie toilet that thing actually looks pretty cool a zombie toilet this thing looks awesome the toilet actually is so unique it even has a little purple yeah she's not lying at all this does look pretty cool and i like it how it has a bunch of the features from the zombie including the head that makes it look really good i even got his spawn eggs that means i can build an army Okay, it looks like Zoe is building a huge army of a bunch of these zombie toilets. So now I have to think, what should I try and do for this first round? I'm thinking since Zoe wants to use a hostile mob from Minecraft, I'm going to do the same thing by using the super cool ender dragon. For this, I'm going to throw the ender dragon head on this side. But for the other side, I'm going to combine it with a cameraman. So hopefully we get a cameraman dragon. That'd be totally awesome. Let's just smack the cameraman down. Now all I have to do is run to the middle over here, splash my potion, and let's see what it ends up doing. And oh my goodness, guys, I think it actually actually worked but whoa it gave our cameraman this ginormous head that's honestly a little bit weird but zoe did spawn in a bunch of those zombie toys on her side so i think i should probably do the same by grabbing my dragon cameraman spawn egg and building an army on my side this is so terrifying just look how big and ugly these guys are it's honestly creeping me out a little bit but of course this isn't the only thing i had planned for this round i do have a secret chest on my side and the way i can actually find my hidden chest by using this thing called the true vision goggles as soon as i put this on it'll just show me exactly exactly where my hidden block is and perfect it's right here now all i need to do is just walk up to it click on it and go into my chest where i have my super awesome size changer this is one of the most useful things in minecraft basically anything i splash this on becomes super super big so let me start splashing this on a bunch of my dragon camera and see how big we can end up getting them and wow guys it looks like they got a whole lot bigger this looks so much cooler than they did before it is still really weird how big these guys heads are but honestly it's not that big of a deal as long as they're strong and they can help me win this mob battle i really don't care what they look like okay zoe i think my army is all ready to go for this first run in our mob battle are you ready for the walls to drop i'm beyond ready you are so going down well we'll see about that zoe the walls have officially dropped and i think i have a great chance to win this seriously you actually think you're gonna win yeah right yeah i'm gonna win zoe i used the ender dragon and it looked like you only used a little weak zombie that was a horrible choice a horrible choice yeah right the zombies are super strong and they became even stronger when i mixed them with the skibbity toilet what did you even mix the ender dragon with like a cameraman or something yeah i used the cameraman he's super strong look how he fights he's like kicking them in the face honestly the kicks do kind of look super cool but why is his head so big Honestly, Zoe, I really wish I could answer that question, but he kind of just came out of the machine with a big head. I don't really know what I did. They look super goofy. Yeah, they do look a bit goofy. I can't even lie, but come on, Dragon Kimberin. We have to win this. Come on, zombie toilets. We got this. Come on, dragons. Come on. You're so much bigger. You should be able to take a bunch of them out. And yes, I think I'm seeing a bunch of you guys taking so much damage. I think I'm going to be able to win this. No way. I still have so many zombie toilets on my side. Yeah, you do. But my guys are like three times the height. And they really can't do anything about this super deadly kick. Come on, zombie toilets. You have to take them out. Just grab that leg that they're kicking you with. Yeah, I think you only had a few left. And oh, man, Zoe, I think the last few of them just got taken out. <laughs> Your army sucks. No, I can't. I can't believe I lost the first round. Well, Zoe, it's not that big of a deal. I still have to win two more rounds when we do the mob battle champion. So let's move on to round number two. And perfect, guys. We completely crushed Zoe. I knew combining the Ender Dragon with the Cameron was a really good idea. But I need to keep winning. So let's use our super cool one-way glass and see what Zoe's going to try and do for this second round in the mob battle. This mob battle is so dumb. I can't believe Dax used the freaking Ender Dragon. I'm gonna have to step up my game. Ha, <laughs> guys, Zoe is so mad. I knew the Ender Dragon was perfect. I'm gonna play some TNT on this side. Wait, why is she placing down TNT? What is she expecting to do with that? And then on this side, I'm gonna use the TV woman because she's like my favorite skibbity character. 
wait guys is he actually trying to combine the team wood with a piece of tnt there's no way this will actually work right here goes nothing and wait guys did it actually work oh my gosh it does look like a tnt combined with a tv woman that's so weird a tnt tv woman this is awesome i'm definitely gonna win this round it looks like it just gave the tnt on top of the tv woman's head that is really creepy but the tv woman is really strong already so i might be a little bit nervous about this okay come on i need to think of a really good counter so what should i try to do since Zoe did use the TV wood, maybe I could use the TV man. I think that's a pretty good idea. And she also did use a zombie for the first round. So that gives me one more idea. What if I use a mutant zombie? So like I said, let me go ahead and put a mutant zombie on this side. Look how big this guy is. He barely fits in the mixing machine. Okay, now I'm gonna run to the other side and put in the TV man. And hopefully once she starts splashing this potion, it makes something really cool. Let's see what this ends up making for us. And wait, did it actually work? And oh my goodness, guys, look, it's the TV man combined with a mutant zombie. That's actually pretty cool. It looks like it did the same thing on Zoe's side. It just took the TV man's head and placed it right on top of the zombie. But since he's combined with the mutant, that means he's gonna be really strong. Okay, let's grab his spawn egg, and now I can start running a bunch of these mutant TV men on my side. This will be perfect. But since we were able to make our mob so quick and we still have time before the walls drop, I think I'm gonna mess with Zoe real quick. And in order to get over in her side i need to go invisible so she doesn't see me so let's just grab one potion of visibility and splash it on our sofa and perfect now i can sneak over there to her side and perfect guys i was able to make it on her side and wow these tnt t women are honestly a bit more intimidating in person my mobs are so strong with their tnt heads i'm hoping that they explode if dax's army decides to kill any of them yeah that's a little bit scary if they do explode they might do a lot of damage to my side well what can i do to mess with zoe real quick and wait a second what if i make all of her mobs fly that would be so funny all i have to do is type in this command right here and oh my gosh guys look at them they're flying what the heck my mobs are flying even the ones that are in the chamber are floating this is so funny at any second they should be crashing down and whoa what the heck the ones that weren't in the chamber died i only have a few left oh my goodness that was so funny we took out her army so quick but oh gosh it looks like zoe's just spawning in more of them this is so lame i need to hurry before the walls drop okay she is spawning a lot more people so maybe i'm not gonna be able to do anything while the round is not even active yet so what do i do something a little bit better but for this i'm gonna need to sneak back to my side so let's head over there real quick now that we're back on my side i can do my prank that i was thinking of doing what i think i want to do is build underground and place a piece of tnt that way once the round starts this tnt will explode on zoe's side it'll be so funny so let me just dig underneath here and perfect now i need to grab myself a bit of redstone and a lever i think what we're gonna do is put down this thing called the lightning storm if you never heard about it it makes a super strong lightning storm okay let me just go ahead and run some redstone all the way back over to my side and then i can place out a little lever that i'm gonna press once the walls drop this will be perfect let's just fill this up like that and perfect guys i think we're pretty much ready for this round to start but who do you think is gonna win you can either comment team tv or you can comment team tnt okay zoe my army's ready to go for this next round are you ready for the walls to drop heck yeah this round's gonna be awesome oh yeah trust me it's gonna be real awesome and here we go zoe the walls have officially dropped for the second round whoa are those zombie golems yes they are and i combined them with the tv man it looks like you use tnt for the tv woman that's a pretty good idea right i thought i was super smart i'm a big brain well now i think it's time to pull my super cool lever let's see what this does what the heck why do you have a lever on your side don't you worry about it zoe and whoa there's so much lightning coming down what the heck where did this lightning come from your stupid lever yes it did and uh wait a second where did all my people go i have no clue but it looks like only my tnt tv women are left what the heck wait this doesn't make any sense i thought the lightning would just take out your people nope it looks like the lightning just saved my people and took out all of yours oh my gosh i can't believe my plan completely backfired on me dax that's what you get for cheating. Yeah, yeah, whatever, Zoe. Let's just move on to round three. I bet you won't win that one. I bet I will. Guys, I can't believe my plan actually backfired on me, but I guess that's what I get for cheating. Well, I kind of need to win this next round. Otherwise, Zoe's going to be ahead of me. So let me go ahead and use my one-way glass wall to see what Zoe's going to try and do. Hmm. 
Hmm, what should I do this round? Oh, I have just the idea. This side, I'm gonna place down a clock. Wait, she's gonna place down a clock. What in the world is a clock gonna do for her? And then on this other side, I think I'm gonna put a multiverse soul. Wait, a multiverse soul? What does that mean? And then I just have to splash some of the potion down and see what happens. And wait a second, guys. I think I made a multiversal skimmy character. I think that's the Titan Clock Man. This looks like the Titan Clock Man. Sweet. It's my lucky day. What in the world? That's actually so cool that Zoe got one of those characters. I didn't know you could do that. And I got a spawn egg. That means I could build an army. Oh, guys, this is ridiculous. I wanted to do something like that but wait a second i think the pedestals are still up and yes the multiversal stole still there okay i have to sneak over there and steal it let me grab myself an invisibility potion real quick let's just splash out on ourselves in perfect now i can sneak over the wall and zoe will have no idea and awesome guys we are over the zoe side but man these tiny clockmen are super big in person this is a little bit scary i am feeling so confident that i'm gonna win this round so confident that i'm gonna take a nap wait did zoe say she's gonna take a nap and oh my gosh guys she literally just fell asleep in the middle of a mob battle but actually this gives me the perfect chance all i have to do is sneak through this door over here grab the multiversal soul and now i can head back to my side and i already have the perfect idea for what i'm gonna do with it. okay let's go ahead and get our pedestal that i can put the multiversal soul on and for the other side i'm gonna use this drilling tnt because i'm hoping to make a titan drill man this will be the most crazy multiverse battle ever okay now that both of them are there let's splash our mixing potion and see what this ends up making and perfect guys i think it actually worked this looks like the titan drill man inside of here okay let me run through my doors real quick and now you grab his star and start building out a huge army this is probably gonna be the craziest round in the mob battle so far okay so i think my army's ready to go for this third round of the mob battle are you totally ready to lose i'm winning this round dex yeah okay we'll see about that i'm dropping down the walls and here we go it looks like the run has officially started and wow use the titan clock man yep I sure do. And is that the Titan Drill Man? Yes, it is. I'm using the Titan Drill because he's one of the strongest multiversal skimmity characters ever. Honestly, he's looking pretty lame to me. What? He looks so cool. So look how strong he is, especially compared to the stupid Titan Clock Man. I may be biased, but in my opinion, the Titan Clock Man is 10 times stronger. Yeah, you definitely don't know what you're talking about, Zoe. My Titan Drill Man are definitely going to win this round, and then I'll be up two to one. No way. I'm winning this round. Well, it looks like your people are starting to take a bunch of damage, Zoe. I don't know. I might end up pulling this out. No way. There's no way the Titan Clock Mans can lose. Come on, Titan Drill, but you have like three different drills on you. There's no way a stupid clock could beat you. Come on, use the power of time. And wait, Zoe, I think you only have this one guy left and he's trapped inside of here. Let me just let him out real quick so he can get beat up. Oh no, it's like 3v1. This is not good. Go ahead and jump him in. Ha <laughs> ha, Zoe, you just lost. Whatever, Dax, there's still two more rounds. Yeah, I guess so, but the score is two to one. So all I need is one more win and I'll be the mob battle champion. So best of luck in round four. And perfect, guys, we completely crushed Zoe in that round. Now I only need one more round left and I'll be the mob battle champion. So let's go ahead and use our one way glass and see what Zoe's gonna try and pull up for round number four. For this round, I think I'm gonna place a spider pig down. Wait, what the heck? She placed down a spider pig? What in the world is this? And that guy is super creepy. I really don't like spiders, but I really don't like pigs. Uh, okay. And wait, she also placed down the Titan Speaker Man? Wait, what is Zoe up to? But the Titan Speaker Man can keep me safe against that pig. So let me go ahead and splash some of the mixing potion. And wait a second, guys. They really make a Titan Speaker Man spider pig? This is really weird. Ah, it still has a spider body. I really don't like this. What in the world? I can't believe something like that actually worked. This is really, really creepy to look at. Honestly, this mob is giving me the heebie-jeebies. I don't even want to use this for my army, but hopefully it makes Dax uncomfortable so he loses. Yeah, it does make me a bit uncomfortable. Okay, guys, I'm going to think of a really good counter for this. I do have one one really cool idea and for this i need to spawn in all of the titan so let's start by spawning in the titan tv man on this side and on the opposite side i'll spawn in the speaker man and the cameraman my hope for this is when i use the mixing potion it'll combine to be one super big tri titan let's see what this ends up making for us perfect guys i think it actually worked look we have the tri titan on our side this guy is insanely strong and since he has the power of all three of the titans there's no way he can lose especially those little spiders over there okay let's go inside and grab his spawn and then I can start placing out a bunch of these tri -tides and totally crush Zoe. Oh, sweet. I found a size changing potion. I just need to splash this on my mom. Wait, did Zoe say she found a size changing potion? Where the heck did she get that? And what in the world, guys? All of her speaker man spider pigs got huge. This is really scary. Oh, yeah. They're huge now. I'm definitely going to win. What the 
heck am I supposed to do versus that? And wait, one of them stuck over to my side? Two of them stuck over? Quick, take them out, the bomb killer. What is going on? Oh no, I think they're crawling over to Dax's side. Eh, it's okay. These guys are super powerful. I don't care if he knows what mobs I have. What the heck? Guys, she's so confident. She doesn't even care if I know. Okay, this isn't looking good for me. Maybe I need to spawn in more Tri-Titans. Hey, Dax, it's time to drop the walls. Oh, wait, Zoe, I'm actually not ready yet. I need like 30 more seconds, okay? Nope. I'm dropping them right now. And what the heck, Zoe? You actually dropped down the walls. Of course I did. I told you time was up. Oh, no, this isn't good. Why are your people so big, Zoe? Because I found a size changing potion on the ground. Isn't it my lucky day? What the heck? That's not even fair. Look, my tri just got swallowed up by these stupid speaker spider thingies. Oh, yeah. That means the score is two to two. Oh, my goodness. I can't believe you actually got a stupid size-changing thing. That's not even fair. It's super fair. Plus, you've cheated worse than me. Ugh, whatever. Let's just move on to the final round. You're totally going to lose this one. Yeah, I seriously doubt that. What in the world, guys? I can't believe she actually won. Oh, that size-changer really helped her out. Okay, I need to focus up since this is the final round. What is Zoe going to try and pull off? Ooh, ooh. I'm so happy that I won. I'm amazing. And Dax stinks. Oh my gosh. I can't believe Zoe's talking so much trash. I'm definitely going to destroy her in this. First, I'm going to place down the spider toilet. Wait, why is she placing on the spider toilet? This guy isn't even that strong. And then I'm just going to try something. I'm going to be in the chamber. Wait, no way. She's going to try and combine herself with that thing. Now I'm going to splash the potion. And no way. Did it actually work? Yeah, it looks like Zoe combined with it. This is so creepy. Oh my gosh. It's a multi-head Zoe toilet. What in the world, guys? What am I supposed to do about that? That's so overpowered. She is so beautiful, and her legs are purple, and there's so many Zoe heads. I think Dax is just going to be like starstruck from my beauty. Yeah, this is not looking good, guys. There's way too many of them. It's just like a bun with Zoe. This is gonna be a big problem, but wait a second. What if I just do the same thing? I know my Tri-Titan would have won last round, and she didn't use that stupid size changer, so maybe I can try combining myself with the Tri-Titan. That'll be perfect. So let me do what she did. I'll put the Tri-Titan on that side, and then I'll come on this side and splash the potion in the middle, and let's see what it does. And oh my goodness, guys, I think it actually worked. Look, we have a Dax Tri-Titan. Now this is perfect. There is no way that so he's gonna be able to win versus me. My guy is way too strong. Well, who do you think is gonna win this final round of the mob battle? You can either comment Team Dax or you can comment Team Zoe. But we all know that my Dax Strike Titan is gonna be a million trillion times stronger. Okay, Zoe, I think I'm ready for this last round of the mob battle. Are you ready for the walls to finally drop? Yep. I'm so ready to become the mob battle champion. Well, we'll see about that. You're going to have to beat me. And since you're fighting the Dax Tri-Titan, this is going to be really close. The Dax Tri-Titan? Oh no, this is not good. And wait, it looks like you did like a Zoe spider. That's kind of crazy. We had similar ideas, I guess. Yeah, I guess great minds think alike, but I'm not sure the spider toilet is as strong as the Tri-Titan. Yeah, I don't think so either. The Tri-Titan's just too strong. And especially when combined with me, there's no way I could lose. But I'm a lot stronger than you are, so I may still have a chance. Yeah, it kind of doesn't look like Zoe. You guys are getting completely smacked around. Come on, ladies. We need to get it together. Oh, this is so easy. I feel like I could just take a nap right now. Oh my gosh. Don't be so cocky. Come on, Dax Tritons. It's only a few of them left. Just take them out so I can get on with my day. Zoe's army's way too weak to be competing with me. Oh my gosh. Dax is so cocky. I'm just gonna take out some of these. Wait, what? Zoe, I literally heard you. You can't just take out my guys. I'm not doing anything. Ugh, you know what? It doesn't even matter. You only have a few of your guys left. And actually, since you took out mine, I'm gonna take out yours. No way. Ha, I took out your last two. Now you have no one left, Zoe. That is not fair. You missed one. Uh, no, I didn't miss one. I took this one out, too. No, there's one over... What the heck? You took that one out? Yep, yeah, Zoe, and I still have this guy over here that you didn't take out, which means I'm the mob battle champion. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe I lost. I really thought I was going to be the champion this time. Well, that was a super close one, Zoe, so maybe you can win the next mob battle. If that was a crazy adventure, make sure to watch the next one by clicking the video on screen. Bye, guys!